welcome back everyone. So, I, we're going to continue our game here, and it now takes us to this screen. So I think I can... It looks like I've earned these two slots, I think. So I've got repost or repost or whatever the hell. Now I can add another one of these that are unlocked. These are not unlocked. So abandon your attack to quickly parry, or immediately follow a swing with another in the opposite direction, or cease a feigned attack to quickly renew it. So, put that one in there too. Oh, so it was only one or the other? Forget technique? Yeah, because I want one of these. Move more swiftly under the weight of your armor. Actually protect partly exposed parts of your body and weaknesses in your armor. Awesome. Okay, cool. Alright, that's what I'm talking about. Randomized. So the progression is, I think, helps to add some variety. Okay, so if you'll recall, we had a zombie that ran away from us and ran in this direction and then ran back. and So there might be a zombie right outside this door. I can't tell. It's too dark in here, it's making me very angry, because I want to use my two-handed weapon. But, we have to make a compromise to see in the dark. Alright, we're going to get stuck on the doorway, because that's what I do every door I walk through. Alright, and again, yeah, this is a place I have never explored before, so this is a region of the dungeon which is still brand new to me. So I'm trying to be cautious. Did I already go this way? I don't think I did. Eh, I probably did. Uh, and then we get stuck on the, the, the wall right by the door, like I said. Oh, shit. Go into combat mode real quick. I wish there was a quicker way to switch my weapon. Let's do it. I got a hit in, even though you couldn't see it. Oh, he looks like he's wearing some decent armor. I'm going to take that from you. Come on in. Damn. Nice. Excellent. Uh, he was using the piece of wood with some nails in it. That's nothing. Four, half, half. Again, it's kind of difficult to compare boots and stuff. Cause, oh, now they stay on the screen at the same time. I didn't, didn't use to. Oh, shit. That's how you do it. These are better. They've got that crush protection the other ones don't have. Waistcoat. This is just a waistcoat. This is a thick waistcoat. So that's better. That shirt is nothing. These pants are nothing. Alright, cool. Okay, so... And it is somewhat dark in here, but I think this area is clear, right? Yeah. Make sure there's no one else in here. I don't think there is. There might be someone further down this way, but I want to see. Get rid of these damn boots. And these damn shoes. And these damn pants. And this damn waistcoat. And this damn shirt. Alright. Just trying to manage my inventory a little better. And I want my torch so I can explore more closely. But I'm going to take it a little slow, because there could be someone at the far end of this room. Doesn't seem to be anything of value here at all. Really? There's like nothing? What is that? Oh, that's more of those hooks. I don't... I don't care how powerful that weapon might be. The effective range is just... It's just going to be, the, you know, the metal hook on the end. Whereas with my metal bar, I can hit with any part of the bar, and it's going to deliver some crush damage, so I don't want to change that. Okay, so I'm going to leave these doors open just so I know I've been here. We've checked these, these doors in that direction, so we'll get stuck on this wall like we always do, and then explore over here. I think I came in over there. I th think... So this should be new. I believe it is. But regardless, there doesn't seem to be anything here. Um, what's that? That's part of the shelf. <laughs> and nothing cool. 
Well, damn. Was that everything in here? I guess it was. Okay. So we'll work our way back. Alright, so this was the beginning, so we need to go this way now to unlock this door. Because this one is locked, right? Yeah. Okay, so key, double click, single click. Swing door open violently. Um, I don't see anyone. Oh, shit. I had to switch. To, I didn't have time to switch weapons. Can I close the door on him? Can I trap him? Oh, damn it. That almost worked. That almost worked. I need to get a parry so I can get that repost or repost or whatever the hell. Give me a... There we go. Then we get a real quick attack. But we have to have a successful parry. Which of course opens us up to damage in case the parry doesn't work. There we go. Cool. What is this? Wooden... That's no, just a stake. It doesn't seem to be wearing anything. Correct. Alright, is there anything in here? No, there's not. Okay. So, let's open that door. Let's check out this... Ah, oh, shit! I really need to be more patient. And more careful. Yeah, run run. Am I limping? I am. Ah, oh, that sucks. Close this door, man. I don't think the zombies can open the door, so I'm not afraid of that one coming back. And I'm not limping anymore. That's good. Okay. Ah, oh, shit. Do we go further this way or check this room out? Let's check this room out. I noticed I never grabbed a compass earlier on in the level. I should have. Okay, and I've looked through here previously in a previous game, and I really don't, I don't think there was anything of value. Despite there being, you know, just so much shit on the tables and everything else. I mean, there's that bill hook, but again, I don't think that's a good idea for me. Well, <laughs> all right, so before we open that door again, let's equip... Oh, of course, it's dark as hell. Come on out, man. Come on out. I'm opening the door for you. He's got a sledgehammer. I'm thinking maybe if I hit him with the door, that might get him out of the way. There we go. Yeah. Oh, I somehow managed to hit him. I don't know how. This guy's rather bulky. Oh. Oh, that was dumb. I should have done the overhead like that. And it cost me... God damn it, it cost me health. That one mistake has just really trashed my run now. It's my health. I've lost some health. I'll never get it back. Ah. Or at least as far as I know, I'll never get it back. Ah, uh, this is all just a... Nah, this is nothing. He's wearing some Bush League clothing. Got some dice over here. Play some Warhammer. Uh... Okay, so let's get the old torch going again and the old cage bar. Tongs. Can I check the drawers? Yes, I can. Waistcoat. I've got a thick waistcoat. That's a light waistcoat. I want heavier armor. Thank you very much. So I'm not taking that. Uh, sledgehammers I don't want. What's in here? Boots. I have crush resistance on my current boots. This does not have them, so no thank you. Okay, let's go over here. I see storage, lots of it. That's a worn leather tunic, which I don't need. That's a bill hook and a cap, which I do need, because I don't have any head protection. Uh, 
that's either a machete or that serrated saw. I think it's both, actually. I don't need either one of them. And I don't need those. Okay. So we checked out these two rooms. We checked out up here. Have we gone in this room yet? I don't think so. Doesn't look like it. I don't see anyone in here, which is good. Let's see if there's anything in here. Ooh, belt. We need that. And these boots. Let's take a look. Oh, come on. Why don't? Why won't it stay up like it did last time? You're killing me. Yeah, well, the ones I'm wearing are better. I mean, just looking at the coverage, it's better, so... That's not a problem. Nice and slow now. That's a bathroom, and I think this is a bathroom as well. If I remember correctly, yeah. Okay, moving on. Alright, so all of this is checked. We need to move this way now. We need to be prepared. I think there's a zombie right there. I could be wrong. No, I don't think that's a zombie. And I hope it's not because it's too dark in that part of the hallway. I can't fight with my damn a metal bar. Can't get into any of those. There's another another metal bar on the ground. Zoom out, make sure there's no one creeping. Doesn't look like it. I think this is going to lead us to that puzzle room that I never could figure out. Of course, I only tried it once. Yeah, I think eventually we're going to end up in the room with like, yeah, here it is. This puzzle shit. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm just, I'm not good at the damn puzzles. I mean, I enjoy puzzles, I do. I know it sounds kind of strange. I enjoy them, but I'm just... If it's not like readily apparent what I need to do, I get frustrated very quickly. And I don't know what I'm supposed to do with this one. Okay, I'm just making sure this stuff is cool. Now, I know that some combination of these levers makes fire shoot up out of the grate in the middle of this room, and I don't know what the hell the point of that is. Um, and there's no, there's no switch to speak of in here. And, you know, naturally the, the gate is locked. It's not just going to open. And naturally, taking the key, double-clicking, and clicking on this is not going to make a difference. So, I, you know, I assume it's got something to do with the levers, right? So, like, the way these are situated, if we pull... Zoom out a little. Okay. So, like, we can roast some marshmallows... But, as far as advancing in the game, I, I don't know if we can do that. So, let's change things. Let's have both levers up. And then pull down. Fire once again. Now, if we have this one down, so this is the opposite of what it was two moves ago. Fire again. And if we move both down, so I believe this is the last combination, we get fire again. So, what the hell? Now, I mean, I have considered, like, dragging something in there and trying to set it on fire, like a stool or something. But honestly, what the hell is the point of that? And are these bill hooks of any use? Maybe, I mean, there's like three of them, so maybe I should pick one up. A rudimentary pole arm. I mean, I don't, I just don't see any reason to carry it. But they, they seem to be telling me, pick up a damn bill hook. So, who's going to move? Come on, man. Okay. This magical stool is very hard to move now. Let's get over here. Let's trip over it. Again, I don't know why the hell I would do this. Other than the fact that I'm stymied and I don't know what to do. Uh, can we not get this through the damn doorway? There we go. Now again, like I said, there's no point to this. 
but I kind of want to see if it'll catch fire. And I know it won't, but... Okay, now there's no fire? Switch this back up. Hmm. So now there's no fire. But again, I don't know what the hell that means. I wonder if you can pull these chains, maybe? Or do something with them? Doesn't look like it. No, they appear to be stationary. Alright, so uh, we'll go ahead and cut the episode right here. I'd like to thank you for joining me. Please like and subscribe if you dig it. And when we get back in our next episode, we're going to try and figure out what the hell to do here. So thanks for watching, and see you next time.